somebody is having a stroke, if he or she is not being, getting treatment, he or, or she can become permanently disabled. We need to know about stroke. It's because we need to take treatment as earliest as possible. Hi friends, hope you all doing well. I'm coming back here. So in this video, we will be talking on stroke treatment. So before going for stroke treatment, I would like to emphasize again that we need to know about a stroke because it's a medical and surgical emergency. And if somebody is having a stroke, if he or she is not being, getting treatment, he or, or she can become permanently disabled and bed bound and you can think that uh, how mentally I mean how emotionally he or she can have in the rest of life so the question is what's the treatment available and uh, how effective is the treatment so before going so the treatment which is available so the question is why we need to take treatment and what is the treatment available. We need to take treatment as early as possible because with treatment somebody is having a stroke can get cured but if not all someone can get cured. So if you talk about treatment options which is available for a stroke we will say there are primarily two modalities of treatment for stroke which is caused by a clot which is a cholesterol clot or clot coming from a heart and uh, obstructing a artery that's a tube which is supplying the brain so one is giving a drug through the vein or the artery so that that drug goes into your body and dissolve that clot so this is called in medical term IVTPA and other is called mechanical thrombectomy where we go, we take a small and small catheters, we puncture, very, we, we do a small puncture or a nick into the groin and from here we reach into the brain. So for your information just want to say that all arteries or the blood supplying tubes are connected with each other. So from here we can reach into the brain using small and small catheters or tubes and we will reach to the artery or tube where there is a clot. So we can take out the clot from there using some suction or some using some stand. We will take out the clot so that that block has completely open and the blood supply of the brain has been restored. So just to repeat again, two modalities of treatment. One is giving a drug to dissolve the clot and another is we go throw inside the body and reach there and take out the clot. So this is a two treatment. It's not my advice. It's not something which I have invented. It's something which has been worldwide practice, which has been, you know, there are uh, multiple papers, which is well established scientifically, which is effective, which is in some patients, which is curable. So I'd like to repeat again. We need to know about stroke. It's because we need to take treatment as earliest as possible. As I mentioned, the drugs, the giving the drugs cannot be given like, you know, you are, you are, somebody is having a stroke and you reach the hospital after one day or two days. This medicines cannot be given because rather than benefit, that will cause harm. So these medicines can be given up to four and a half hours. I repeat, four and a half hours from the problems when onset of your problem. To dissolve the clot and the treatment options for going to the clot and taking out the clot can be offered up to 24 hours nevertheless you should remember it's always better to reach hospitals a comprehensive stroke center where this treatment is available as earliest as possible thank you